There's probably not a single topic regarding Julian that makes my blood boil than that endlessly recycled lie that he didn't redact. I understand Julian is not everyone's cup of tea. Um, he was my cup of tea, but I understand he wasn't everyone's. So I really wear loads of criticism about Julian, but I cannot tolerate that he didn't redact. Uh, I was with him uh, for the, the month, uh, travelling with him and, and living with him effectively, for the month before that release, which was the first big release, and I was there intensely in the three days before. And I can say emphatically, I, I, I won't elaborate uh, on this uh, platform, but please accept my word, and, and I, can, uh, I can elaborate in any other forum, that emphatically, Julian Assange removed 10,000 names, no small task, 10,000 names from those logs uh, of people who had potential harm, and he did it around the clock for three days with no assistance. There was no journalist there. There was no organisation there, no media corporation, no digital team. It was Julian Assange. And yet, to hear that continually peddled is... Uh, uh, frustrating to say the least. So I, can, I might ask you this one favour. If you ever hear anyone say that, pull them up immediately because it has done incalculable damage to Julian. It's been used by other journalists to sneer at him and, and to somehow distinguish what they do from what he does. It's damaged him in the public and effectively it was used by the prosecution the Americans used it as the distinguishing feature of Julian Assange to the others. So please pull it up immediately. Uh, uh, tell them I said so. Tell them I'll come and get them if they say it again. Uh, and that I was there and there was very few people there.